This wheel is going to adjust everything. So I'm going to call this the wheel or the dial. All right. When you want to change the ISO, there's the ISO button. When you want to change the aperture, this AV button right here is the one that you're going to want to hold down. And then um, to change the shutter speed, all you have to do is dial in that wheel. So if I just start moving that wheel, you can see that these numbers down here keep changing. So I set my um, frame rate at 24 frames per second, so I just want to double that. So I'm going to change that to 50. The next thing that you want to do is you want to change your aperture. Now I've got my ISO set at auto, so it's going to automatically adjust. Later I'll show you how to manually adjust that if you want. But I'm going to let that just automatically adjust based on my aperture. Now aperture is key for depth of field. So for example, if I want my front bear here to be in sharp focus and nothing else, I'm going to make my aperture as small as I can. So in this lens, I can go down to 1.8. Now you can see that the bear in the distance is very out of focus. And my bear in the front is in sharp focus. So a low aperture number is going to give you a shallow depth of field. Now if I want both bears in focus, I'm going to need to change this higher. So I'm going to hold the AV button down and dial it up. And I'll go up as high as I can get it, 22. And now you can see that they're both in focus. So aperture is...